Hi, Yarnabees. Oh, I'm a hot mess. How are you today? I, yeah, <laughs> been having a bit of a week. <laughs> um, but anyways, um, I need some advice from you. Oops, sorry. I need some advice from you guys. Okay. I seem to be developing some sort of a skin issue or allergy or something. I don't know what's going on. <sighs> but um, this sweater I made from the Hirschner's Worsted 8 uh, Heather that just came out. And I was so excited to use it and I couldn't wait. <sighs> and then I got halfway through the back panel of the sweater and I started itching like mad, mad, I tell you. It was like I had been working with wool. Um, and this is 100% acrylic. So I contacted Hirschner's and they're trying to contact the manufacturer to find out what's going on. Because I thought, okay, it's got to be this yarn. Today, I started working with my fa one of my favorites, Premier uh, Ber Bernat Premium, and this is from Walmart, and it's 100% acrylic, and I'm going itchy like crazy. I am devastated, you guys. I'm I I've been on Benadryl for days. I struggled through this. I wanted to get it done because um, I'm actually donating this sweater for a really good cause. And I'll talk about that on another video. But um, yeah, I don't know what's happening. I'm just, my skin just feels like I'm being bit by a thousand mosquitoes and it's burning. And I'm going, what is going on? When the yarn's going through my fingers, it hurts. Like I have cracked skin or something, but I don't. Um, and it's acrylic yarn. I have absolutely no problems with acrylic yarn. So I contacted Jennifer from Cinnamon Stitches because I know she has skin issues too. She says she didn't have any problems with this yarn. Granted, she just did a swatch, but it, she would have known right away if it was bugging her. So I don't know what's happening. I have no idea what's going on. Um, is, has this happened to any of you? Because, like, I don't know. Is my skin changing? Uh, I know your blood changes every seven years or something like that. And you develop allergies that you never had before sometimes. But this is off the wall crazy. Like, my skin is just... I, I'm trying so hard not to scratch. i got to take a Benadryl. Just having my clothes on is making me itch. I have no idea what's happening, but I am just so upset about it. Um, I had to have a bath to try and, you know, I, I just, I was like, what is going on? So anyways, if you guys have something like this, can you let me know? Because I don't want to have to go to the doctor and he's just going to look at me and go, yeah, nothing I can do about it, you know, or take a Benadryl or whatever. You know, like this has been going on for days, not just like one little problem, like one little episode. So I just, I don't know what's happening. But anyway, I'm just, I'm so miserable right now. <sighs> so anyways, and I know it's nothing like scabies or anything like that because I haven't been around anybody and I know what scabies looks like. And it's not that. I don't have any bumps. I don't, I don't have a rash. I don't have hives. I don't have anything like that. Like nothing. It's just my skin's itchy and burning. So anyway, let me know. Okay. Now that I've said that, I got a message from Dina from Homespun Fun. And she was saying that she had sent me something from Amazon and there was a postage issue. So I went running down to my post office to see if it was there. And lo and behold, it was. 
So I've got it right here. I haven't opened it yet. Um, so let's get into it and see. I just, I can't even believe that. Like just out of the blue, she contacted me and says, I sent you something. I'm like, what? Really? Like, oh, that's so sweet. She's such a sweetheart. I love Dina. Okay. Ah. Alrighty. See, here's the box. Of course, they put the Toronto Maple Leafs on here. We're Canucks. We're not Maple Leafs. <laughs> but anyway, just saying. Oh, what the heck is this? Oh, oh, look. Of course, I didn't bring my glasses in here. What the heck is this? Hi, sweet Sandy. I watched your video and saw how down you were. I hope this cheers you up a little. Stay strong. You are a wonderful person. From Dina. Oh, you're going to make me cry. Oh. This is such a cute bag. I love these bags. What the heck? Let me in. Let me in. How do I get in? Sorry, guys. It's taking me a minute here. Oh, my God. A box and a box and a box. <laughs> says for you Whoop. Oh, for darn sakes I just dropped it <laughs> hold on what the heck is this happiness as a symbol of pure happiness elephants signi signify the strength needed to overcome life's obstacles said to carry everlasting luck in their trunk one facing up means you will have you will maintain good luck forever so grab the world uh, grab the world by the tusks and ride yourself into great fortune oh you guys Lynette, look what I got. Lynette from Charm Grammy loves elephants. Oh, you guys, look. Can you see it? How adorable is that? Oops, sorry. Look at that. Oh, Dina. That is adorable. Thank you so much. <sighs> oh, that is so cute. Look, it's, it's, it's like a baby. Oh, <laughs> so cute. Oh, I'll have to get George to put it on for me. Thank you so much. That, that, oh, that is so sweet. You have no idea how much that means to me. It's, it's been a bit of a rough little go, you know, of late, as of late. That just, oh, my heart. It's, that, I'm, mm. Thank you. 
That's all I can say is thank you. Like, that, that just, that was such a surprise. Oh, I love you so much. Like, the my Yarny family is amazing. They're just absolutely amazing. You guys, you always find a way to lift me up when I'm feeling down. If that just means... And thank you so much for the e-cards for Thanksgiving. Um, that was totally unexpected too. Um, most of my yarn of, Yarny family are from the States. And your Thanksgiving isn't until next month. So for you guys to send me e-cards saying thank, Happy thanks, Canadian Thanksgiving. That was so sweet. <laughs> you know? And you know when I'm when I'm down or when I'm hurting or when I'm in need or whatever, you guys always come through. And I just, it blows my mind. It just blows my mind for, I mean, Dina is a busy, busy woman. Like she's constantly go, go, go. I don't know how she does it. Oh man, I would have gone cuckoo Lulu long time ago. <laughs> but for her to take the time and the care to, you know, to send me this to make me feel better, that just, oh my gosh, that warms my heart so much. Thank you so much, sweetheart. I'm going to wear this every day. <laughs> and I can show it on my videos. Look what Dina got me. <laughs> it's so pretty. Oh, unbelievable. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Um, yeah. Thank you. Uh, okay. I'm going to go because I'm going to start to cry. Um, so yeah. Thank you guys for joining me. Thank you so much, Dina. I love you. Um, and you guys let me know what you guys think. Cause I'm, I'm just don't even want to have to deal with my doctor because my doctor's not anyway. Um, so yeah. Oh, this is so cute. Thank you. <laughs> okay, guys, I'm going to go. I love you all. I really do. And, uh, yeah, for all my Canadian friends out there, happy Thanksgiving. And I will talk to you guys soon. Okay. Bye.